Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have my second Wandering in Wonderland haul. So the first one that I did, I was super, super excited about, loved everything. I mean, I still love everything, but I was always missing her restocks. <laughs> like I never really kept up with it. I kept forgetting about it, but I knew that I really, really wanted to order again. And thank goodness, one of you guys messaged me on Instagram and told me that she was about to have a restock that day. So I was like, oh my God, yes. So I went in and I didn't know how fast her stuff was going to go. I didn't know how popular she was. So I was trying to just get everything as quickly as possible. Um, and I'm not really familiar with her stuff. I'm not familiar with her scents. So I was kind of just like, okay, um, grab stuff. So I ended up placing three different orders and she did say that she combines orders and if you pay over shipping, she refunds you, which is great. Um, I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh, so I wasn't like really remembering exactly what I was getting. So I ended up with a lot of doubles, um, but I kinda, not that I didn't do it on purpose because I knew that I wanted to get doubles of things that I thought I would like, but at the same time, a I think just like one or two of them I forgot the name of it and I was like oh I didn't realize I ordered two of those uh, so yeah I do have a lot of stuff here I'm really excited about it I've been dying to order from her her stuff is the cutest things ever all right let's just get started because there is quite a bit to go through all right so I did get a couple samples this first one is in a lollipop and it's like in a little bunt thing this one, not really for me. It's like way overly fruity kind of. So I'm not crazy about that one. And then the second one that she gave me is fresh strawberries, baby powder, and pink chiffon. I cannot do baby powder. So I don't know, maybe I'll just give them away in like a swap or I don't know, a random act of kindness or something. All right, so I'm gonna show you the super cute stuff first, like the cakes and all the shapes or whatever. And I guess I'll just show you the stuff that I end up getting doubles of, I guess. All right, so here's the first thing. It is a three layer like wedding cake. Oh my God, it's so cute. And this is in her 16th birthday. I can get here. So this is pink sugar, raspberry something and strawberry. What is that? Oh, raspberry guava. This smells amazing. I honestly mostly just smell strawberry and pink sugar which is honestly totally fine with me. I love this. So I ended up getting two of these. Here's the second one. They all look the same pretty much. So cute. All right, then I grabbed um, strawberry a la mode, which is strawberry parfait, cake bake, flaky pie crust, drizzled with layers of fresh strawberries. And this is what that looks like adorable i also had no idea how much these things were gonna weigh what sizes they were gonna be because it didn't really say on the website um i think the prices to be totally honest with you are a little bit steep for the amount that you get um however you do kind of have to factor in that these are like really kind of probably hard and time consuming to make and you need extra you know oils and extra decorations and stuff so i do kind of get it this smells so good though. It reminds me of like a really creamy, birthday cakey, fresh strawberry scent. So there's two of those guys. Here's the second one. All right, next up is Cookie Crisp. And this is in chocolate chip cookie dough and vanilla waffle cone. So cute. The labels are adorable as well. Oh my goodness. So cute. This smells amazing. You guys know me and I love my chocolate scents. This is kind of like a hot chocolate to be honest with you. It's super creamy and it's super strong and I love it. So there's two of those. There's the second one. I feel like they're so delicate. Like I'm scared to drop them just because there's so much like detail and stuff. And my camera of course doesn't do them any justice at all. I should have taken some of these out so you could see them a little bit better, but oh well. Okay. The rest of like these kind of shapes, I only got one of. This one, I'm really disappointed. I really wish I had gotten two of these. 
But this is in Mrs. Claus Gets Baked, which I think is so funny. So this is baked strawberry bread, baked zucchini bread, waffles, vanilla ice cream, and hints of fresh strawberries. And that's what she looks like. So this is like a little souffle with um, ice cream and strawberries on it. So cute. I'm obsessed. Strawberry bread has been one of my favorite scents lately. I'm loving it. And mixed with this zucchini bread, oh my god, this is definitely my favorite scent out of all of them. It is amazing. And I'm so sad that I only got one. However, I did get more strawberry bread scents. So I guess that makes up for it. Okay. And then I got this one, which is all that jam, strawberry jam, fluffy marshmallow, and zucchini bread. So it's a little bit similar, but I do like the strawberry bread a little bit better though. This smells really good. I wish it was a little bit stronger on the strawberry, to be honest. I could take it out a little bit so you could see it. I don't want to take it out all the way and kind of like ruin it, but. There's like a bread here and a little music note and a strawberry to kind of match the label. It smells good. I like it a lot. If I can close this bag so we can move along. Okay. And then I just got some other like random shapes. So I got some Cine bonbons, which of course is frosted cinnamon rolls. There's four little guys in here. This is amazing. Her cinnamon rolls are on point. So good. Then I got Carnival Cotton Candy. I love this label. How cute is that? Oh my God. So this is just fresh spun cotton candy. I have her cotton candy and I love it. So when I saw this, I actually grabbed this last minute. I feel like maybe it was on the website, people grabbed it and then someone dropped it because I swear it was not there the first or second time that I was in there. Maybe I bypassed it, I don't know. This is so good though. To me, to be totally honest, it kind of smells like a strawberry-esque cotton candy, but I love it. So there's a little star in here. And then there's also, which is my personal favorite, look how cute, a llama. It's a llama. Oh my God, I don't have any llama wax. So this is a first for me. Oh my God, I love this. So cute. Okay, moving along, I got more of her pinwheels. I loved these. These are so convenient and so easy to use. So I got two of the flaky pie crust. Her pie crust is so good. I'm so stoked that I got two. I love this. It is super strong, super sweet. One of my favorite bready type of scents ever. So I got two of those. And then I got donut jam, which is strawberry jam and sugar glazed donuts. So I got two of these as well. Um, but it was funny because this is one that I got in my swap for, um, with my godmother. And she had about half of one left. And she was like, here, smell it, see if you like it. And I was like, oh, yeah, I do like it. Came home, melted it, loved it, saw it on the website. And I was like, yes. So I got two of these. So good. I like her strawberry jam scent a lot. So there's two of those. All right, then I just got one in Hay Sugar, which is sugar cookie dough. I have one of these already, so I didn't really feel the need to get another one because I like it, but it's not something I absolutely have to have. It's amazing. It's sugar cookie dough. It's kind of the same from every vendor. All right, then the last pinwheel that I got is in Sugar Pie, and this is sugar cookies and flaky pie crust. This one I tried to get two of, but it wouldn't let me, so I missed out. It's good though, sugar cookies and pie crust. Very straight and to the point. These are beautiful, by the way. I love kind of like the tie-dye effect she kind of has going on. All right, then I got, oops, then I got a few of her heart clamshells, which I have never seen these before. This is a first for me. Let me show you. So this is what they look like. It's like a regular size clamshell. It's just that there's hearts instead of the regular cubes. So this one's in Frosted Fruit Loops, which is Fruit Loops Frosted Sugar Cookie Royal. Royale, whatever. This is amazing. I love her Fruit Loops scent. It is so good. 
super, super strong and super realistic. I don't get much of the sugar cookies, but it might come out a little bit more when I'm melting it. And then I ended up getting two of this one, which is Luna Love Good, which is strawberry bread and sugar-coated marshmallows. I had to get more strawberry bread. Had to. Oh, my God. It's so good. Her strawberry bread, I think, is in the top runner for me right now of favorite strawberry bread oils. It is amazing. Crazy strong. Move this. And then here's the second one. I like how everything just looks a little bit different, obviously, because it's all handmade. So everyone has something a little bit different about it. Love it. Okay. I got to make some room for this last one here because it's a big guy. Okay. You guys ready? Oof. Okay. So it's a ginormous <laughs> gummy bear loaf. Here she is. Oh my God, this is, ins I can't believe I buy stuff like this. What is wrong with me? Okay, so it's three-toned, green, pink, and blue, heavy. I think it's way, o I think it's over a pound, definitely over a pound. I think it was like a pound and like one or two ounces, I can't remember. But this guy is in Sweet Dreams, which is vanilla cotton candy, blends of cherry, strawberry, sweet sugar, crystal confections. So the only thing that worried me a little bit was the cherry, but honestly, looking at this thing, I was like, I need it. <laughs> I don't care. I need it. It does smell really good though. I'm glad that I opted for it. To me, it smells basically kind of just like a cotton candy sugary, sugar cotton candy. It's really, really good, but I have no idea how I'm going to like break into this and melt it. It's just way too cute. I think it stands up. Oh, look, she does stand up. Okay, cool. Does she or does she not? I don't know. I feel like she's going to fall over, so I'm going to lay her back down. <laughs> okay, so that is everything. I know it was kind of quick, but um, I think a lot of you guys are kind of familiar with her stuff by now. I know that I haven't shown a lot of it, but she's clearly getting more and more uh, popular by the second, it seems, because uh, I'm always seeing people haul her stuff and very much, how do I say this? She deserves it. <laughs> I can't think of words right now. It's almost 2 o'clock or past 1 o'clock in the morning, so my brain's a little bit fried. Um, but, yeah, very much deserved. I can see why people love her stuff so much. I'm really excited that I was able to get my hands on some stuff, so I can't wait. <laughs> but it's just going to be really hard to cut into this stuff, like the cakes and the gummy bear and the um, souffle cups. I mean, the clamshells and the pinwheels, those are easy. I can, you know, cut into the llama if I have to, but... The rest is going to be a little bit hard for me. <laughs> All right, but that's everything, you guys. I'm not going to babble on too much because I still have lots to do. So thank you guys so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. Um, I hope you guys are all staying safe, healthy, and sane, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.